what is up everyone i'm here back with another video and in today's video i'm making a special video because usually you guys know i post nba live mobile videos but in today's video i'll be posting a pokemon go video so you know everyone's playing this game pokemon go like from teens to adults to kids to everyone okay and a lot of you are wondering since a lot of you cannot actually go outside because either you don't have cellular data or if something restricts you from going outside or something like that and a lot of people just want to be able to play Pokemon Go have fun just like everyone else is so in this video I'll be showing you guys how to spoof your location so you guys can play Pokemon Go in a different place and you guys can basically play from your house so disclaimer I do not suggest doing this alright because Niantic is known for soft banning people who spoof their location but if you do it I would suggest making another account I personally do not spoof my location I enjoy playing the game by actually going outside and doing everything so I would suggest not doing this I don't do it but if you want to or need to then I'll show you how to do this so there's methods on YouTube on how to do it for iOS but there's not that many for Android so that's why I will be showing you guys a method for Android users so if you guys are iOS user I might make a guide for you guys later on but for now in today's video it will be about Android so what you first want to do is you want to go on your Google Play and you want to type in fly GPS so fly GPS is basically the app you use you can see I have it installed so you just want to install it and while it's installed you want to go to settings you want to go to settings and then what you want to do you want to go on go to system and if you do not see this option called developer options you'd want to click about device and you would want to click build number five times so you guys can see it gives you a notification saying developer option has been turned on but if you do not have developer options on it'll say doing it in five four three two one and then you'll get the developer options so make sure you have developer options and then after that you want to go to lock screen and security and you want to go to unknown sources and turn that on so you can install apps from sources other than the play store so after you're doing that after fly gps is done installing you want to go to developer options and in mock location app it'll probably say none or no apps but you want to click fly gps so after you click fly gps what you can do you guys can see i'll play pokemon go right now without fly gps on and you guys can see where i am and i'll show you guys after with fly gps the difference it makes and everything i just made a new account for this tutorial you guys can see I'm in an area with like no Pokestops, barely any Pokemon, no gyms or anything. And now I'll show you guys with 5 GPS what you guys can do. So you want to close out a Pokemon Go. You just close all your apps, whatever. You'd want to go to 5 GPS. And right now I have it set on Santa Monica because Santa Monica Pier because I think that's a very cool place. So you would want to just select whatever. So Santa Monica Pier, you'd want to click please select menu and you'd want to click GPS service run. And since you want to do this for Pokemon, you click the bottom one joystick location mode Pokemon and you guys can see you'll get this notification saying po this started and you guys will see you have a joystick and you would want to click Pokemon Go again and now I'll show you guys what appears alright guys now you guys can look at this I'm in Santa Monica as soon as I just open up the game I get a Kabuto and I get you so many Poke stops and the game is the same exact you guys can see I can just capture it and I will actually get it it's the same exact thing, there's no difference, and I'll show you guys how to walk around and everything. So let me just capture this, just to show you guys that it's the same exact thing, except I'm in a different location now, I'm in Santa Monica. So, look, I can just move around, whatever, let's just see, like, I got a medal, alright, look, let's just try to move with this joystick. You just want to move up, and look at this, I'm moving on my own, just with the joystick, I'm just at home doing nothing, I'm just moving with the joystick. And you guys can see all this, I can do gyms, battles, stuff like that. I can do whatever I really want. So this is a great way, like I said in the beginning of the video, if you cannot play Pokemon Go outside or you just don't want to. And I know there's a lot of methods with iOS, but this method is for Android. So if you guys did enjoy the video, smash a thumbs up and let's see if we can get 200 likes on this video. I've never asked for 200 likes. Let's see if we can get 200 likes. If you guys do like Pokemon Go or NBLI Mobile, please subscribe to my channel because I do mainly post NBLI Mobile, but occasionally I might post Pokemon Go. And just like I said, this is a disclaimer. If anything happens to your account, do not blame me because I told you guys that you guys could get soft banned. So just use a new account. And I would not recommend this, but if you did want to, then you guys could. So anyways, if you guys did enjoy the video, like I said, smash a thumbs up and let's see if we can get 200 likes. 
and subscribe to my channel because I make NBI mobile content daily. Until next time, guys, have a great day and peace.